Welcome back to another video. In this one, we are checking out the museum. So we are going to head to the museum the old-fashioned way, which is to travel there without using any forms of join command. I don't even know, honestly, if the join commands work. Oh, before I get to that, I will just mention this person right here. I already mentioned him in a previous video, but you've got the blue cloak, and this is a legendary item that you can obtain cosmetic item and it says you need five of the blue capes in order to obtain this i'll go into more detail on this in another video but for now we're going to be heading this direction also if you're wondering why there's a ton of people hanging out here it's because for a limited time there are some items in here like some of these lower items right here that you can obtain without even owning the stuff now chances are this is just temporary and everything that you think you got for free you're actually just gonna lose because they're gonna end up wiping your inventory of those items regardless and those of us who do own the badges will just be able to reacquire them out of the shop welcome to the museum so there's Danica. We've arrived to the museum. Talking to Danica. Hello, welcome to the museum. Hi. Where are my manners? Danica Rose, the museum's curator. Great to meet you. Didn't know the museum was open. That's technically not. I'm still working on getting it ready for visitors. You're welcome to have a look around, though. Sounds fun. Will do. So that's what we got to do. Take a look around. We've got some foliage. Oh, okay. Just a tree. We need to enter. Hey, nice foliage. Inspect the window. Ooh, I like that. Look at that. Those are, that is a super nice, this is actually a nice map because I really like those windows. Look at the sun gleaming in. That is really, really nice. Where am I clicking here? Oh, right there. Stained glass. Classy. Look at the corner display. It says this one is for guardians. Mm -hmm. But is it for guardians? Dun 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 dun. That's one thing you don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Pile of dust bunnies. <laughs> that is actually kind of funny. Big display. Big things. So these are where the monsters and stuff appear from based on the cutscene that we... Or not the cutscene. Based on the image I showed in one of my previous videos. Hey, you're back. What do you think? It's empty. It could use some work, but I see a lot of potential. Me too. Imagine my surprise when I found out I had inherited it from an old relative. I was in Arkengrove working on my chronomancy studies when I heard about it. You're a chronomancer? That's so cool. Thanks. Is there anything I can do to help? Now that you mention it, I do have something I could get help making this lobby look good. I'm in. What can I do? Well, at Arkengrove Academy, I specialize my skills with what is known as the Sisters of Time. Is that a call? No, no, no. Sisters of Time are an offshoot of chronomancy who believe that the fabric of time and space consists of focusing energy that they call moments. Moments? Yep. Once you can find moments of time and space, you can use them to create all sorts of chronomancy spells. And how does one find one of those moments? That's a great part. They are everywhere. I'm hooked on this idea. How can I help? When can we start letting people in? Before we let the pub public in, I feel we need a good opening exhibit. What exhibit do you think will work? That's my issue. Lore is so amazing, I don't know where to start. Wow, I see what you mean. I've been adventuring around for a while, and I wouldn't be able to pick my favorite either. I would. It'd be easy. This is tough. We want it to be something the town will be interested in. I've got it. How about I go around and ask some people in town what they would like to see? That's a great idea. Get the people involved and maybe generate a little hype for the opening. I have some ideas of who to ask. I'll start right away. I won't let you down. I'm excited to see some time magic. So we need to go and ask Winnie what she thinks, which means we need to jump to the Battle on Town Square. Hey, Winnie. Hi, can I make you look fantastic today? Well, more fantastic. Normally, I would say absolutely, but today I'm looking for the thoughts on something. Go on. Danica Rose is opening the museum again. I love the museum. I used to go there as a little girl. There was so much to learn. What do you need from me, though? Danica was wondering, what should the first exhibit be? There are so many amazing things around Lower. 
Really good point. Let me think about that. Hmm. I love Darkovia. Those outfits are amazing. Ashfall had a great color palette. Solid points, I agree. But now that I think about it, I'd really like to see an exhibit about Greenguard. Greenguard? You bet. It's a fantastic and magical place, and I have a fondness for Earth Tones. And she really does, too, so that's funny. One vote for Greenguard. Thanks for the info. Sure thing. This is exciting. I can't believe the museum's opening again. Okay, so now we got to go into Yogurs and talk to Yogur. See what he has to say. Greetings, traveler. Care for a room for the night? Not today, my good man. Right now, I'm looking for information from you. I don't know who told you, but I swear it was self-defense. What? No, 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 no. I'm here to get your opinion on something. My opinion is that it was self-defense. <laughs> That's funny. Forget all that. Have you heard that Danica Rose is reopening the museum? She is? That's fantastic. She was in here last week and never said anything about it. What does she need? Well... What she really needs is help picking the first exhibit. There's so many amazing locations around Lower Green Guard. You don't want to think about it a little bit? Nope. Sure about that? As sure as I am that it was self-defense. <laughs> He's still going on that. Thanks for the input, Yogur. Missing a comma right between input and Yogur. You have a great day. Okay then, my friend. I'll see you later. <laughs> that is, that's funny though. Self-defense. And we are now off to the social district. Now, since you could technically jump there the fast way just by traveling to the House of Oddities, but I'll just travel there the old-fashioned way. Looks like the Carnival has been removed. Hi there. I'm asking people of Battleon a question about... Shh, you'll scare the fish away. Oops, I'm sorry. No worries, mate. What can I do for you? Well, the Battleon Museum should be opening soon. That's great, but what does that have to do with me? Danica, the new curator, was wondering what everyone wanted for its first exhibit to be. You don't say. Laura has so many amazing places to choose from. That's what I said. Shh. Fishing here. Right, right. I got excited. Now that I think about it, I've always been fond of Greenguard. I've heard that a lot. What attracts you to Greenguard? The vistas? The wonders? The hidden secrets? I'm from there, actually. I was hatched just outside the of Barrow Point, or Barrow Drop. So it's a familiar place for... Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I think I misheard you. Did you say you were born near Barrow? I said what I said. Right. Vote for Green Guard, check. Have a great day. That's funny, they're whispering the whole time. Battle on District. So we got to go out the little door right here, out the little gate. Talking to a random person, we got Guardian Soldier. Halt! Who goes there? He looks different. It's me, Gold Raven. Oh, right. You look different. I didn't recognize you. Look how he looks so crappy. That's so funny. I have a question for you. Green card. <laughs> Why does he look so dumb? Oh, man, that's funny. I had a feeling you'd say that. Wash your hands and stay out of the trouble. Quite hilarious. So we got to go back to the... Okay, well, I'm just going to jump back like this. And we need to talk to Gaz and see... Or Gaz. Gaz or Gaz. Not, I, I guess it's Gaz. Talk to him. See what he wants to say. Greetings, hero. What can Gaz do for... Oh, it's you. Me? Yeah. Gaz has heard you poking around town asking questions. How did you know about that? There's like 40 people in this town. Word gets around. You know about the museum opening? Gaz knows it all. Danica Rose, new museum, new exhibit, like Gaz said, word gets around. So, do you have an input? Gaz votes for Green Guard as well. I'm sensing a trend here. You're very observant. Alright, we have to head to the magic shop. Talk to Warlick. Who's also going to want to go to Green Guard. Hello, Warlick. I'm sure you know why I'm here. Actually, I don't. You haven't heard about the quest I'm on? Well, I've been in multi-dimensional trance for the past few days. Great for the sinuses, but bad for staying on top of the local news. Wow, okay, well, this is great. Danica Rose is reopening the Battle on Museum. Wonderful. I've known her for a while. Danica and her cousin, v Valencia, cool. That's her cousin, would hang around my shop for hours when they were kids. Valencia would 
gaze at all my artifacts, and Danica would pour through my books on chronomancy. She had a specific interest in the books on the Sisters of Time. She's using all that knowledge to get the museum up and running again. She asked that I go around town and ask people what they wanted. What the wanted? Ask people what the wanted they first exhibit to be. <laughs> How thoughtful of her. I've talked to quite a few people already and I'm sensing a trend, but would love to get your expertise on the matter. What do I want the first exhibit to be? Hmm. Oh boy, here it comes. There are so many magical locations to choose from. That's true. To pick just one is a real challenge. Doom would be would be pretty scary to start with. Yeah, the Green Guard Graveyard. I mean, sorry, the Dragon Graveyard is a sight to behold. You're really dragging this out, aren't you? Oh, I've got it. Green Guard. Heavens no, the eternal beaches of the reverse moon of Glorotha. Oh, that would be an interesting place. I did not expect that. I hope this helps your quest. It kind of does in a weird way. Thanks, Warlick. My pleasure. Farewell and safe travels. So we need to go to the museum. Now, can we? Is there a shortcut to the museum? Can you get there via museum? Yes. That is a much quicker way of traveling back to the museum. Welcome back. How did it go? It went well. Everyone pretty much voted for Green Guard. Well, everyone except for one person. Let me guess. Warlock voted for the beaches of Glorotha. Yes. He went there like 10 years ago after I showed him brochure and he won't shut up about it. You've been there too? I thought he made it up. Don't get me wrong, Glorotha is really amazing. There's just too many devil spiders there for my taste. Devil spiders? Yeah, I'm out. So Gringard, huh? Okay, this is going to take a few extra moments to create an exhibit wing from scratch. Wait, the museum doesn't have exhibit wings? I see doors, where do they go? Thanks to the Sisters of Time, they can go anywhere. And right now, we need them to go to the Gringard exhibit. Here, this might help out. She did a magic spell. What just happened? Do I have another head? Just a little Sisters of Time spell to help us out. I taste cookies. That can happen. It should go away in a few minutes. Speaking of time magic, why don't you meet me in the newly created Green Guard exhibit? All right. That's what we got to do. Got to go check out the Green Guard exhibit, which is in one of these doors here. It could be maybe maybe both the doors lead to the same thing. I don't know. Green Guard exhibit. Yeah, there she is. Danica Rose. The new wing is ready for displays, Danica. Time magic. Thank you again. This is really making a dream come true for me. I love visiting this museum when I was a little girl. This place means a lot to every one of us here. Knowledge has that power over people. This museum is what inspired me to be a chronomancer. What do you mean? These exhibits and displays are like little moments in time. Even as a kid, I found it almost magical. Sounds like Sisters of Time stuff. Spoken like a true chronomancer. Maybe one day... Speaking of time, we have a museum exhibit to fill. So, what is the first display you think people would like to see? Well, from my time in Greenguard, I remember there were quite a few frog zards. You're right. Those guys have a wicked bite for sure. I know. I, I mean, I know I need to collect moments, but how would I go about collecting moments? Well, this is the best way to explain. Go rough them up a bit. Eventually, if you believe enough, you will find a moment with one of those nasty beasts. I've roughed up quite a few frog zards in my time. I've never gotten any moments from them. Were you trying to make a moment? No, I can't say that I was. Here, maybe this will help. Another magic spell. Hmm, shortbread. That should do it. Head on over to Green Guard Forest and collect some Frogzard moments. Bring them back here when you're done, and then you can do some time magic. Amazing. I'm off. So that's what we got to do. Visit Gringard Forest and knock out a few frog zards. And then you get the Gringard exhibit placard. So we're going to grab that. Placard. Not sure how to say it. but So you, you see other people in here, but we don't see what they're... We won't see their display. When we, we see our own display, we won't see theirs. But it's cool that they're all in the same... Thing. And I love these windows. Also, look at these banners right here. So now we need to take out 50 of the frog zards. And there we go. Just like that. It didn't take very long to complete it. So we're going to head back to the museum. And we are going to turn this quest in. Yes, Sisters of Time. 
You did it. I hope you returned with all you fingers. All you fingers? Touch the exhibit display and boom. And now we have another one. Oh, Megazards. And then you would be getting a Megazard. So there, there it is. There's a Frogzard we collected. And we've got other moments here that we can collect as well. We've got Sneevels. And you get these things from that. You get the King Sneed. All these things. Oh, my. And you get some really good XP and gold from completing these, too. That's pretty nice. Collect moments of those. So, 100. So, that's basically what you need to do there. Let's go check out the other exhibit. We've got the Underworld exhibit. Ooh, interesting. There's a whatchamacallit there and some can some Legion candles about. And some of these monsters are from the Yes. Okay. So these these are from the Underworld. Need to get all of these ones here. What's in here? Just one? I thought it was gonna be a whole bunch like in the Green Guard one. Okay, so that's basically what you're doing you're collecting moments from monsters you need to fight monsters in order to collect the moments i actually like the idea behind that because i like collecting things not sure what the reward for all these are this i wanted to know where this door goes is it does it go to the same thing as that no it doesn't it goes to heartwood it goes to a heartwood oh yeah okay and this looks different too still i really love the how gleaming in there that man it's a nice looking map so then you've got these ones all with different things and you get these placards time magic is amazing plus it tastes like cookies placing that display tasted like snickerdoodles exactly what's next let's team up for this i'll stay and curate this just every display you bring in i'll work with the people and help open new wings with a little time magic indeed you go out and collect those moments from all around lore there's so much to collect together we'll make this museum the best in battle on maybe even all of lore i really appreciate all you've done to help with the sister of time on our side this is gonna be a blast so there we go and then you have, so there's three different options right here. It talks about getting displays, talks about the available things are already available. And then on who she is, you've got completing. So there's three different ones currently available. The first of which is Green Guard. I already have one, so I would need to get 13 more. And then I will be able to unlock whatever you obtain from this what do you obtain from this it doesn't say but and then here you have another thing for the living stone you'd need to obtain all of those temp why does that say temp text and then we have this one underworld exhibit complete so and then upon doing so you're going to be getting a title because it does say that you receive a title i'm not sure what else you get along with the title but have to wait until you unlock all of the different stuff i like the idea behind this i think this is a really cool idea what do you guys think of the museum let me know in the comments below now if some of you guys have been wondering there's some issues that have been going on with the server and, and different shops having accessibilities and stuff well, that's because they did a whole database transfer which put them onto new machines and i'm sure this is what's caused some of the issues that we have been facing as in the locked shops being unlocked and certain things like that dragon guardian is apparently unlocked if you're a guardian i'm sure all those problems will be reversed once they are aware of it or once they figure out how to fix it but as far as the museum update i think it's pretty good i really enjoy the museum but that is it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and keep those swords swinging.